I want to give you guys a positive message before this video starts. Drop out. Hey my movies, I'm back with another video. Today in this video, I'm doing things that you need to know before you enter high school or you're already in high school, you just want to notice or you just a true fan and you watch every video it was like mm, okay but anyways I got a list of things that I need to get down and talk to y'all about I want this video to be really quick so let's get into this the first thing I gotta tell you about is do not stress yourself about homework and all this work if you don't want to do it don't do it simple as that I'm just joking but like you could skip some homeworks here and there and like skip some projects here and there but just don't do it to where you're failing and just like you know you need to breathe you're a human too you need to listen to this i need a break don't don't bother me the next thing is do not be a typical freshman and get all the school supplies that's on the school supplies list because 90% of the stuff that they're asking for, they don't even tell you, they don't even, it doesn't even come up. They don't, just have paper and a pencil. Which leads me into the next one I got for y'all, is your main essentials in order to go through high school with the breeze without teachers nagging you up and down. You gonna need your phone, if, if, if you don't got a phone, um, you need a paper, pencil, a uh, charger, because your phone is going to be dead. And this is, um, these two things right here is what you need. That's going to make high school a lot easier. And it's headphones and money. Because there's vending machines there and, you know, you could treat yourself with a snack or two. So the next thing I got is fake friends. I know every YouTuber says this, but let me tell you, you'll be into school like the first like five months and you'll be like, um, I don't have any fake friends. But by the time you hit summer and you see all the people, not even not all the people that hit you up, like all the people that like just faded, you'll see, damn, those people are fake as shit. And then just the smaller the circle, the better you live. So, you know, small circle, the better you live. <laughs> it's like, you need cheating buddies. Cheating buddies, you need to have a group chat. If you don't have an iPhone, I'm sorry to say, but you're f***ed. Because, um, that's how we airdrop answers and like you'll be on your phone like hoping somebody airdrop answers you're like studying and then you look at your phone and be like such and such want to airdrop and you click it and it's the answers to the test so i don't know how y'all school works but that's how um certain classes work where i live so you know and sometimes majority times in school there are subs so play iMessage games or that uh crazy eight game that i mean <laughs> i'm a winner <laughs> like, i want to say be friends with upper classmen they already have all the answers they already did the work that you did let me tell you a little quick quick story so my friend he we are, we are freshmen the girl was a sophomore he took this girl's essay well he didn't take it the girl gave it to him he asked for it and she had a 70 he changed up some words and got a 98. He didn't do, he just changed up words. You get a 98? <laughs> I'm just saying, cheat. <laughs> um, it's not, it's not technically plagiarism. Like, say if I just, say if I took Chris Brown's new song, Instrumental, I changed up the tempo, put my name at the bottom, add a couple of bops to it. And boom, it's my song now. If you a girl, don't fuck with upperclassmen. Like, mm, they only want one thing. But if you want that one thing and they want that one thing, y'all on the same page, y'all could be on the same page. But yeah, they want that one thing, you want that one thing, hey, just do it. But um, the next one, do not send nudes, especially your girl. Guys too, but mainly girls, like... 
if I just want to say you can see news, you know, it's, it's you, your body, your decision. But like, just know when you send it, the person that you send it to, they're not, they're not the only person that's gonna see it. They're homeboys, they're friends, people sell them. It's crazy. <laughs> and um, don't be a typical freshman running to class when the bell rings. Take your time, sis. But do not walk slow in the freaking hallway. Do you understand me? It is so irritating where like you have like a strict teacher next period and they be like you have to be on class such and such or unless you get such and such and the people in front of you walk it slow the hallways are packed like please move it along bro like i'm not trying to write bro yeah um another tip stay away from drama you live better you just 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 stay away if you're the drama type you know go with drama go with drama but like it's not even worth it because the things that you're stressing over 10 years from now it does not matter one bit i mean like if you're stressing over like you just murdered somebody oh uh, yes that matters sis but like schoolwork drama friends it doesn't matter so do you do you Watch what you post on Snapchat and Instagram, mainly mainly Snapchat, because people could th hold things against you and take screen screen screenshots and screen record shit, and you just don't want that, okay? <clears throat> Stop posting your freaking life on Snapchat, cause nobody cares. <laughs> um, another one, um. Don't be popular. You could be well known. There, those are two different things. So definitely <clears throat> try to be well known instead of popular. Cause popular, you get enemies. You get all this other stuff. People stabbing you in the back. You don't need all that. You you don't. It's not even worth it. Please, this is for mainly guys. Stop in claiming colors. You don't rep no freaking signs like. Like, no, what you doing? Like, no, stop. If you're not about that life, don't do it. I'm not about that life, but, like, when you start repping stuff and you just know that you're going to have enemies and you're putting your family and y yourself mainly at risk. So why, why are you doing that? To look cool? Like, no, you look dumb. What, you got arthritis? Uh, this is another way to expand your friend base is go to like team games and like meet up with friends Be like oh you trying to go to the team game at 8 o'clock, you know, that's what people do you can join teams Join clubs. That's how you expand your friend base on uh, Usually people that go to uh, teams and clubs. They're For the most part nice, I guess That's how you produce more friends and I just want to say, remember you're in high school, okay? So, relax, okay? Don't stress yourself. You need to chill out, you, you know? Have some time, you know? Go to a party on Saturday. Go to a high school party. You know, if a teacher's stressing you that you need to finish the essay, it's high school, bro. I'm just, my main message here is to do not stress yourself of something that's not going to matter like 10 years from now. That is like my number one message, okay? Just don't, you don't get your, you don't get high school again. You get it one time, four years, three years if you're lucky, if you do all your credits. But four years, you can goodbye. Just goodbye. You're not even gonna see them again. Maybe you'll see them when that high school 10 year comeback thing. You'll see them, you'll see uh, the people that was popular and are now crackheads and the people that always was shitted on are now like YouTube stars or models and stuff like that. So you know what? That's what I gotta say. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and don't forget to hit that red subscribe button down below if you haven't already. And without further ado, skedaddle skedaddle goodbye. Bye! Why you gotta do this? Uh, why you put me through this? Uh, why you gotta do this?